Poison gas will give you an advantage during the war. Whereas a person can hide from the gunshots, they can't hide from the fumes. The only way to avoid them is to use a gas mask, which your enemy may not have. The first to use poison gas were the Germans against the French in the Second Battle of Prez in 1914. It gives you the ability to attack your enemy without getting close enough for them to fight back. Poison gas was invented to cause confusion and panic for the enemy. The Germans used it in battle and were unsuccessful in defeating the French, but it did take a toll on the French and Canadian armies. If used correctly along with the element of surprise, it could eradicate an entire army. It's very costly to produce poison gas, but in the long run, it will be to our advantage to use it in the war. Some of the types of poison gas used in the war include tear gas, which was used by the French first in August 1914, and the side effects are that it is tear-inducing. Chlorine gas was first used by the Germans in April 1915. It causes damage to the ears, eyes, nose, and lungs, and can cause death. Another type of gas used was the phosphogene gas, used by the French in 1915, and the side effects include damage to the lungs, causing suffocation and a delayed reaction. Phosgene and chlorine gas were used by the Germans in December 1915, and it also causes damage to the lungs and suffocation, along with delayed reaction. Another type of gas that was used was mustard gas. It was used by the Germans first in July 1917. The Side effects include internal and external blistering and bleeding and damage to the lungs, which is sometimes fatal. Poison gas will allow us to effectively win the war and destroy the central powers. The gas masks will allow you to use the poison gas without being hurt by it. The United States Army should adopt this new technology because it is the direction the world is going in and it is an effective this way to win This is an image of a gas mask that is used in World War I. It will protect you from the fumes as it covers your face so you are not affected by the chemicals in the gas. This is an image, a battlefield image, of poison gas being used. You can see that the people in the image are wearing gas masks so they can cover themselves and be safe from the poison gas. Lastly, we have an image of some of the gas mask shells that were used and you would set it off on a battlefield and it was used to release the gas.